Yeah. Baby, girl, you're so damn fine, no. Wanna know if I can hear it from behind, dog. I'm sipping on you like some fun wine, dog. When it's over, I press the wine, dog. Talking bands, I got it. Benjamins. What is up, YouTube? I'm back with a new type of video for me. Um, and it's going to be a bit of an in-depth type of video. Uh, basically, what I wanted to do was compare Black Ops 3 on the PS4 and the Xbox One. Uh, and the differences that I found over the three days that I've been playing on them. Uh, three days might not sound like a lot to you guys, uh, but I have played on Black Ops 3 since launch day on the Xbox One and the PS4 for the last three days. And I'm already noticing some quite major differences between the two systems. So that's what I want to go over today. It's, it's going to be a bit of a, a messed up video. There's lots of different elements to it. Uh, I've already recorded some footage, which I'm going to play for you when we get to a section about graphics and stuff like that. Just just try and keep up and watch along and, and we'll see what happens. I've got a list of stuff in front of me that I want to talk about, uh, so it could all get crazy. We're going to switch over to here because my list's down here, my screens are over here. I can kind of see what I'm doing. Um, so we will start with... Uh, what should we start with? Um, so we'll start with the graphics. We may as well start with the graphics because that's what everyone looks at when they're playing these games. Uh, and I've recorded some comparisons which you can see up on screen should be about now. Bing, they should be here now. Um, to me, the PS4 blows the Xbox out of the water. The contrast in it is much richer. The details are so much crisper and sharper. I thought the Xbox One looked nice when I played it since launch. Um, and then with when I switched on the PS4 and loaded into the game, I was like, holy shit, there's a massive difference. Um, everything on the PS4 looks crisper. The, the Xbox One, it's weird. It looks washed out edges of everything look soft to me um you can see on the pictures on the screen now let's take take a note of the camo uh, and the gun fuck why why dog my dogs man they were asleep before i start recording this video they were asleep and now he's woken up and decided to go ape shit right so um yeah take special uh attention to the camos on the ps4 side and the xbox one side and you should see hopefully if you're playing this in 1080p hd you should see what i'm seeing and it's a huge huge difference um, I don't know what they've left out on the Xbox One. Um, I would have thought, personally, they were uh, able to do the same amount of graphics. I know people have said that the Xbox Run uh, runs this game at a lower resolution. Um, and I can kind of see that is. Uh, you can see in the detailing on the tank there is different on both of them. Um, there just seems to be a richer element to the PS4. So graphics, personally for me, the PS4 wins hands down. Absolutely, no problem at all. Um, I'm going to leave that screen just to look at my lovely face now the rest of this uh, we'll talk about map rotation now we all know about the combine 24 7 issue that everybody's having <coughs> levi pack it in get down leave her alone Come on, get over there leave her alone stay there uh the combine issue that everyone's having um it's more of a problem on the ps4 it doesn't seem it comes up a lot on the xbox one but on the ps4 i literally i could play it all day long if i didn't leave lobbies so uh xbox one wins on the map rotations uh, plus, the Xbox One is using all the maps. There's a map on PS4 that I don't even think's in rotation anymore. I can't remember what it's called. Uh, not Breach. I don't, I don't know what it is. You're not, you guys know what I mean. But there's definitely one that's been taken out of the PS4 rotation for some reason. Uh, so Xbox One, it wins on that one. Uh, map rotation is better. Uh, gun hit detection. So this is basically when you shoot someone. It registers as a hit. Better, faster, uh, and, and as if you were shooting them. Pardon me. PS4 wins this. Um, I get so many um, false hit markers and stuff on the Xbox One, it was unreal. PS4, I haven't had any at all. Uh, and this sort of coincides probably with my next one, uh, which is connection. Connection, I use uh, the same internet on both machines. I don't do wireless. I plug one ethernet cable into the back of whichever console I'm playing on. So the connection is exactly the same. On the Xbox One, I run a three bar on anybody's server. Doesn't matter who I'm playing with, it's a three bar. Uh, and I'm used to that, I don't mind it at all. I have an open NAT type on both machines, in game and on the console. On the PS4, all lobbies that I've played in so far, I have a four bar. That says quite a lot about connections to other players and uh, I don't know, it's just better on the PS4. My hit detection is perfect. Uh, it feels like a better game and hence it plays better because the connection is better. So PS4 wins on connection. Um, this one's a bit of a silly one, and I don't know if it means anything at all, but the supply drop luck. I've obviously been opening supply drops on my Xbox One since I've had the game. I don't know how many I've opened. I've opened a mix of commons and rares. 
I've got some good stuff on the Xbox One, but I have no of the new melee weapons. No of them. None of the new melee weapons on the Xbox One. My very first opening of a rare supply drop on the PS4, and I get the butterfly knife. Is that because it's on the PS4? Is it because I was a new account? Is there anything to it? Who knows? But compare thousands of openings to one opening and I get one of the new weapons. I don't know. Nobody wins on that one. That was just something that happened to me. It was quite funny. Um, hackers, hack lobbies, the, the thousand level glitches, all that sort of stuff. I hadn't seen a thousand level on Xbox One in the entire time I played it. I've seen three on the PS4. Um, there seems to be a lot more hacking going on, on the PS4. People are talking more when I'm in game about hack lobbies and stuff like that. So unfortunately, I think the PS4 is more vulnerable to hack lobbies and stuff like that. I don't know if it's true or not, but I've certainly seen it with my own eyes now. Um, so for hack lobbies and people doing that sort of shit, my match has ended. That match over there wasn't even playing. Uh, the Xbox One wins down for that because I just didn't see any. Um, connections we've done. Controller, this is a bit more of a console thing and not the game, but I'm still getting used to this controller. Um, I'm almost there. My main issue with it is the distance of the um, left analog stick. It just feels like your thumb is constantly stretching over. Uh, and that is obviously down to personal taste and it being a new controller for me, so it doesn't really win either side at all. Um, menu systems in and out on the games. Um, PS4 seems a lot quicker to load up the game. Uh, and sort of navigate around inside it. I don't know if it is. I haven't really done a side-by-side -side comparison on that. Uh, they both sort of do the same. If anything, the PS4 is ever so slightly quicker. Who knows? Uh, what else do we have? Did the hit detection controller we've done? Map rotation we've done? The graphics we've done? Luck on drops we've done? Hackers in the PS4 done? Connection times we've done? Startup times? Um, the startup time from the games, I was going to run a video on this, but it, it's seconds um, difference. PS4 does load it up from dashboard two game with the app quitted uh, and loaded in it does load up quicker so yeah it's interesting um being able to play both obviously I have a lot more pals and buddies on xbox one so i tend to have a better gaming experience from a personal level over on the xbox one but that's only because i've only just got the ps4 um i really like it i really do like it and i didn't think i'd like it as much as i do um gameplay wise ps4 wins sort of enjoyment level because of I've got more friends on Xbox One, Xbox One wins. Um, what are your guys' thoughts? Do you have both consoles? Do you have one or the other? Please leave a comment down below and let me know your thoughts um, and see what, what's going on with everyone else. Um, I covered pretty much everything I wanted to cover. I've got no idea how long this video is going to be, if it makes any sense at all, but this is today's video. Um, so enjoy. Peace out, y'all. See you soon.